Hey guys, IX7 here, and in today's video tutorial, I'll be showing you guys how to free up some extra hard drive space on your Windows computer. So let's get started. You start up and select one. If you do not have run, just select um, on your keyboard Windows R. So, and then just type in percent sign, temp, percent sign, press enter. And you should have all these things in um, side of this folder. Just want to highlight them all and just delete it. Don't worry, it won't mess up anything. They are just temporary files that you do, you do not need. Next thing you want to do is go to run, or again, Windows key R. This time, type in pre-fetch, just like that, and select enter. And here are a lot more things, just the same thing. You want to highlight them all, and then just delete them. Okay, that's that, and I actually have a list here, because I cannot remember them all. Uh, the third thing is delete unwanted files. This is a big, big deal. Go to your shard group and select computer, and go to your hard drive, users, your username, and then go through every one of these uh, folders, look through every folder inside of these folders uh, for any unwanted files, and then just delete them. After you do that, um, you want to do get rid of useless programs. So this basically means uninstalling programs you don't use. So go through um, all these items and uninstalled items that you do not use. And if you go to the le uh, left here, just click this um, thing right here. And this is basically the Windows features. So let's say I don't use Internet Explorer 9, just uncheck it and select OK. Um, so there are a lot of um, useless programs and items here that you don't even use. Just um, go through this list and uncheck them. And after doing that, you want to do disk cleanup. So just type in disk cleanup. And this thing will pop up right here. And it says it's calculating. Just let it do its thing. And then this thing will come up here. You just want to make sure everything is selected. And select OK. OK, the next thing you want to do is uh, download this cool program called C Cleaner. So I'm just going to search that here. And this is basically what the program looks like. You just want to go through all of these items here. So select Analyze, Scan for Issues. And this is basically um, your uninstall guide kind of. And this is what it, your um, computer is starting out. This is your system source, and this is Drive Upper. You don't really need to worry about this right now. And this is just extra stuff. So, yeah, that's it. Next thing is defrag. This is a big thing. Um, you can do the um, Windows defragger, I mean, this defragment, or um, this other program I downloaded. It's called Ultra Defrag. It's the same thing, but this actually works better. So just defrag and optimize, and you're done. And this uh, number eight, I recently just found out about it. It's this neat little program, which um, it's kind of like C Cleaner, but in a different way. You just want to select all the things um, you want to scan for, and then scan for it and delete um, all the things that you want. And if you go to more tools, there's this thing called CC Enhancer. This basically does, it adds um, over 270 new items and programs to CCleaner. So if you just select that, and download the latest, it would add extra things to CCleaner. So click yes to open it. And if you're wondering where the extra things are, just go to applications and you'd see tons and tons of more options to choose from. So that is that, and I already said that, so I guess that is pretty much it. Oh yeah, and this extra thing, 
It's called Tree Size. It's this uh, little program which tells you what is taking up the most space or how much space is this program taking up. So you just want to open that up. And you will see this little box here. And go to Scan and select your C drive. And it will scan your whole thing and find out what is taking up what. So the most thing that's being taken up is folder windows. And this is the most thing that's taken up. So this is just a, a little neat tool to help you find out what is taking up how much space. So that's pretty much it for this video tutorial. If this video was helpful for you in any way, please rate, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace.